Bilharani neng oka akapak kaldang babu phara oni kaldang soma ona re gpa rama sorukrang namja ani gman ya ong ing gpa opos tharang ko nirokachina gta ahamdol deputy commissioner na lekha sedwa ta ha ahamdol ni khobor na phara katani gta de kaldang babu phara oni kaldang soma ona re gpa sorok ko je kon thari na gta ba chinga hacham u kho thari gi jakal chpania selwa jol ni rama sorukrang Namzainga ha aru jolu dunga pa mandirang na menik ni kani kumat toke nga ne kobor na parakata ha. Soroko tari gijakal cipani a selwa chini sumayrango uwa rama gata gari gora rangko salaniyo ba aru sayang gapa mandirang ko sana bananiyo raru rana gata bu wajol ni mandirang bang anik ni kani rang kumat ni nga ne organization ni dilga parang kobor na parakata ni ko takata ha. Ya soroko hazal gini kulgriksa bilsi yonin thari na gata ba chinga hacham ndi ba wat rama ko thari ki jakal cipani a sel tau na ba machot kujay nga uni gaman ya rama ko kham kaani rang ko ni roka china gata a ham dol ni dilga parang tipiti kamishnar na lekha sedwa ni ko taka ha ne kobor na parakata ha. Anga klinton armarak a ham siyebe ni headquarter ni general secretary nda ke mang anga yan kaldam rung strek. Sorok ko ni, ya ba kaldang bau parau ni, kaldang sungguh nak buka bunga ni gemeng yara rumusek sungguh nga ni gemeng ya ko within twenty four months on complete kan akan acim rama ko, ya ko iya ni rama ya construction ko, ni ba tau hajar gini korbuk sao ni kagen cuma ba tau macut kujeng ni gemeng baka ya nu sungguh kebarang baka ni gemeng ni kumat ni nga tau ni kita ke school ni kebarang ba sah dengan ni kita mat kebarang kari kurang nara agak bana. Belum ini negara ni kumat nengah, ini kemen anga government ko ba amul mulat naskah wan dek absen nengin district authority ba PWD officer angko ba amul mulat naskah kat sape nak si mangira marangko ni rokat demeng nak ya kamarang jen pendingu edong inga cum barangko kat sape ay sungi nuki mandirang na dang nami macut tiu kucina ni menang amul mulat naskah wan dek tau je contractor ni ya ko mat nacum nak si mang bah kat sape ay barangko Opposition Party ni Dilgapa Pasaleng Sangma Mijal Sal ni Bako State Government ya Job Reservation Policy ni Bidungo ni Pultaya ni ko dakken ba Adoko Sungdong Gapa Manderang na ya Kamrang ni Bidungo Final Decision ko un agata Chanchen ni rang ko takaha ne kobor na parakata ha Kamrang ko namda patani ko dak na gata dengtang dengtang Parti ni Dilgapa rang baksa Sanchirma ni ko dakken ba ya Reservation Policy ni Kamrang ko mungsong gapa ung ni Kamrang ko kakci na gata Chief Secretary baksa na gapan saka ni member rang ko Komiti na seo ka ni ko dakaten ba Ado ko sungdong gapa mandirang na ka e janggi thangci na gata Kamrang ko nakatat na gata ba Surkari agan gurka ni ko dakma na ha ne ba ua aka na nga ha Reservation Policy ni gaman thalata ni ko dakke ngon mekalaya Surkari Ado ko sungdong gapa mandirang na kamrang ko nakatate ungen chumo ba Uwa mang na nakatat kaman kamrang tukja ni ang selbang at sa dambirangan Kapan adok ni nung o kampanyi rang o kamrang ko ka echa na gatari ang toke nga Nda ke ong ingon megalaya surkari adok tango na Ya nda kapa kampanyi rang ko rabagin chumo de Je noktang rangon graduate ong e kamrang ko man gija dungi nga chum Uwa nda kapa mandirang na kam ko ka echa na gata mang sanam gapa chol ba ong gen ane ba I want to thank Bar then also regarding this particular entire scenario because without him, people from the Garo Hills would not have been aware of what is going on inside. That is the first thing I want to thank him. And the second thing is that even the government, especially, we are not, uh, you know, adhering to whatever, uh, what do you call this one, whatever job, whether it's uh, one, two, whatever delivery mechanism it was supposed to be delivered it was not doing so so everything is uh, enlightening it seems like so we had a discussion yesterday along with the, all the other you know political parties also it was a good discussion healthy discussion and then uh, now government is doing a job also now they have appointed uh, chief secretary is one of the committee i think they said that there will be a three members committee but yesterday i was suggesting uh, commission would have been better because uh, commission, uh, if we set up a commission, you know what, uh, they can reach to the unriched people. Uh, and then all those uh, unprivileged, where they cannot speak out, uh, they can go to that DAP actually and understand their 
economic status because we are not only talking about one uh, community or two community. When we are dealing, we have to deal with all the other uh, uh, tribal who are staying within our state and the backward class within our state and the economic weaker section within our state. So likewise, they have to go to you know each and every community and then each and every individual who are unprivileged and who are unrich actually. Reservation is what? Reservation for the unprivileged and then weaker section of the society. So can they can be lifted up. So that was the whole point. That's why uh, whatever the government is doing, whatever the people are you know, pointing out, it's a good thing actually. It's a good way actually. At least it's a healthy to add the view of each and everyone. It's a good one. That expert panel which we are talking about right now, uh, uh, you know, will confine to certain area. But if they form a commission, that would have been more uh, say. That's why I was telling you that uh, at least this commission would have reached to the unrich people where they cannot speak out and they can understand uh, who are the like weaker section of the society economically and then like uh, how many of our people uh, you know from the Garo, from the Kasi, from the Jayantia have got this particular privilege from the day one whether their family is still holding on to this you know uh, 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 privilege that is being given by the reservation policy because as a matter of fact, the one who has got this particular privilege, for example, if I've got the engineer quota, okay, from the reservation policy, if somebody has got the engineer quota or a doctor quota, at least their particular family should not be counted under this reservation anymore. Because the whole objective is to uplift. Since that particular family has been uplifted, you know, that means at least they, their family is been able to fight with the other, uh, you know, uh, sector of the, you know, community. So that's the whole objective. Now we need more multinational companies within our state, private players who can come and then you know uh, do some business out here so that our people, youth will be employed, they will not go outside the state because any graduated or unemployed youth who are going outside the state, they are working in the private companies. So why don't we bring the private company to our state? So that way we can at least absorb our youth to get employed. Otherwise, look at the government job. Look at the, you know, the status of the MPAC. Okay? It's all negligible, actually. Our youth getting job within our state is very negligible, actually. We're talking about the reservation every now and then. But look at the job created by the government every year. It's only like hardly 100, 20, 100, like that. Okay? But thousands of our youths are being graduated every year. Where do they supposed to go? Hmm? They will become alien outside the state. So we have to bring some companies where we can absorb our children. Mijazal ni bako ICDS ki merong rangko ong gija takke takkao sretani kam rangko independent committee rang ni report on ani jakmano cabinet minister Pauling do TMC party ni ko sakko sengdua ni rangko takang aha ya ICDS kim ni merong rangko takkao sretani bidungo cabinet minister TMC party ni ko sakko report rangko thari and baya thari gaman report rangko porai in ni ani jakmano wamang antang thang ni kam rangko ong za nen gensem bau i gensem ong ode Antang thani kam ka ani commission rang ko matnas kangan antang thani kam ko wateri ang nanangen ene ko bora tham ko parang na parakata ni ko takaha. Why didn't they go and depose before the commission? You have all the liberty. If Kong Agnes can go, why not Mukul Sama? Why not George Lingdo? Why did they go and depose? If they can steal anything under the sun, did they go and depose? I have just uh, shared with you last week a copy of this report. So now in the next session, it will be tabled. Anybody can read and I comment without reading.